I have never met a super strong-willed kid who was not also extremely intelligent. And I'm telling you this as a warning because if you find your kid overwhelmingly strong-willed, then most likely they're smarter than you too. And so I know there are going to be people who are like, well, my belt is stronger. And so perhaps while they're little, but these kids do not break. They just wait. And so if you would like to have a good relationship with your kid as adults, then most likely you have to make better choices. And so a couple of the things that I know worked not only with my kid, but also the, all the kids I've worked with where I could tell that they had the will of iron that I had to be able to win them over so that I could work with them. And so one, that is, I made the choice to not lose my temper or yell at these kids. And that is because they are very intelligent and they have an incredible amount of self-control. And so yours has to be greater in order to be able to earn their respect. Number two is I made sure I had a lot of time to have conversations with them because since you're not just yelling at them, you have to be able to talk, listen, lecture, convince, teach. You have to have the time to be able to have these long conversations. My conversations with my one kid could clock three hours every other day. The longest one I had was seven hours. But now at the age of 26, I can tell that all the things that were said at that time that he was actually listening. And the last is you have to be so careful with your word choice. And that is because these kids do not forget anything you say. And also you have to be able to have the encouraging words to pull them out of their head because these kids think, wait.